evening. How are we doing so far? Not bad, huh? Well, over the past six years, ESPN has worked with the top filmmakers all around the world to bring incredible stories, stories of hardship, stories of adversity and triumph to the small screen tonight. We are proud to preview the next chapter in this award-winning documentary series, 30 for 30. What if I told you that on one night, a man stood on the edge of greatness and threw his career off a cliff? ESPN presents 30 for 30, What's So Funny, the Joe McHale SB monologue. What? What? My monologue ended like 15 minutes ago. I know you guys crank these documentaries out all the time, but how is this possible? But who's producing it? I typically do films that are designed to inspire people. This time I want to do something completely different and do a film that was super, super boring. I don't know what Brian Grazer is talking about. I playfully ribbed some millionaires. I came out against the Confederate flag. I don't know what I did that was so awful. I think most award show hosts would agree it was pretty great. I honestly don't know what Joel was doing in his monologue. When you perform in front of athletes, you need to be perfect. Any stumble, any mistake, they're going to notice. That's just how... No, not now. We're filming. Sorry, can we do it again? Maybe it was the pressure being on a show that people are actually going to watch. Do you remember where you were the night laughter died? Wow, they've officially run out of 30 for 30 topics. I love party subs. I'm no longer the most hated man in sports. That definitely goes to Joel. And he doesn't even play sports. I bet he sucks at sports just like he sucks at monologues. See? Lambeer gets it. And it was at that moment when I realized our assistant coach was blind. What? Well, let's look at the bright side of Joe's family. I got his gig hosting the soup. I am on his web series community. I started having sex with his wife. You know what? It's cool. I know how these 30 for 30s play out. They all end in redemption. Not this one. My advice to Joe is to get the hell out of L.A. But hey, that's my advice for everybody. Me too. But they don't always listen. These are going to be easy to sell. How did you get so many people to participate? Why am I participating? Uh, stay tuned for 30 for 30. What's so funny? The Joe McHale SB monologue. Who the hell is Joe McHale? Immediately followed by 30 for 30. Hannibal Rising. The rise of Hannibal Burris and the death of Joe McHale. Yeah.